angel fly within my life beside me and all I do. Hi beautiful people, I'm Anna Grace Taylor and welcome to your weekly angel reading for August 31st through to September the 6th. I'm going to be using the Angel Tarot cards by my friend Radley Valentine. So let's see what the angels have to say, first of all, for Monday and Tuesday, as we end one month and begin another. Okay, oh, so this is really interesting. Don't often have this card pop up, but it's the Knight of Air. And this card can be intelligent, decisive, idealistic, and tireless. So it could be the qualities that you feel as we begin the week or the qualities that you want to bring out or even the qualities that you could do with in your life right now. And it says, events that occur with great speed, take time to carefully review your options and creative solutions. So what that says to me is that we want to definitely use our brains. The air suit is very much a mental one. And quite often we talk about following our hearts, don't we? But we definitely want to take our brains with us as we make decisions beginning or at the beginning of the week. This can be um, being impulsive though as well. So watch for that, definitely. Again, as we talked about, really listening to our hearts as well as our minds, um, really allowing ourselves to just go with the fact that this energy is quite quickening. It can mean often that the energy really speeds up, that we want to real take action, but still making sure that we're being sensible about it too. And that can also go with our love lives because we've talked a lot about relationships in the last week or two. And this card can mean a knight in shining armor, which of course is beautiful. If someone sweeps you off your feet, I definitely want to hear about it. But again, listen to your head as well as your heart. Follow your heart, but take your brain with you. Don't allow yourself to get completely carried away, all right? Ah, oh, interesting, because then we do have the flip side of that card, which is the High Priestess, Archangel Haniel, and she does say, listen to your intuition, have patience, consider carefully what you want before acting. So because we have that along with Monday, Tuesday's card, I would say, yes, it's great to take action. If the energy feels sped up, then go ahead. But this does feel like a bit of a warning to just not get kind of carried away too much. Still really listen deeply to what you really feel is right for you and that balance between your emotional intuition and your intelligence and your logic is gonna be really important this week, it feels like, okay? All of the aspects of us are important because we're divine beings, totally connected to our inner wisdom, but we're also having a human experience as well, okay? Oh, and then this brings it all together with another air card, the King of Air. So definitely quite uh, a mentally stimulating week. It's brilliant, impartial, professional and diplomatic. So again, these could be qualities that you want to bring out in yourself or particularly around other people that could support you because it says, speak your mind with confidence, seek out professional advice, balance mental and emotional considerations. So I feel like the weekend's card is just summarizing everything that we've already said. And to remember that we don't have to do this alone. So if there is somebody that is really great at the thing that you want to get done right now, don't be afraid to ask for help. Similarly, if you have something that is really bothering you, for sure, ask for help. There are lots of people with lots of different skills. We're not supposed to be doing this life thing on our own, whether that's a professional experience or a more emotional one. Okay, so a really good reminder, absolutely, that we are both our heads and our hearts. We are intuitive, but we can also bring the practical element of our lives very much in the forefront as well. And that when we have both and when we take care of both, everything is going to be much uh, easier for us and really make a real difference. Okay, so 
Have a gorgeous week. (laughs) Follow your heart, but take your head with you. And that includes asking other humans to support you on your journey. If you would like me to be one of those people, you can absolutely contact me at annagracetaylor.com where you'll find details of my 30 minute or one hour sessions. We can connect wherever you are in the world via Zoom or Skype. So if you have questions for your angels, if you would like clarity, if you would like some support and advice to help you to really make those choices, make those decisions and take action, I would love to support you. Have a gorgeous week everyone and I will see you on my Facebook page and my Instagram for the daily angel messages and also if you haven't seen it, I am sharing a special event this Thursday, September the 3rd at 1pm Eastern, 6pm UK time, where we really will connect to our angels, really focus on opening our hearts, listening to our intuition. I'm going to be leading you through a heart opening meditation and teaching you the three major archangels that can help you to open your heart. And I will also be taking some questions as well. So if you would like to join me, I'm going to pop the link below. It's just 22 US dollars or 17 pounds, uh, English pounds. If you would like, you can even just purchase the recording if you can't join us live, but would love to see as many of you there live as possible. Have a gorgeous week. Bye bye for now.